that stress reduces stress. It's like an appropriate level of stressful activities in one area, but it helps us reduce in another area. Um, it also can be used to like pay off to ourselves as a job well done. Rewarding yourself with something that you have accomplished and you didn't know you could do, and you're proud of yourself for it, so you can like, uh, like say if you're on a diet, you reward yourself with like chocolate or cake or something. And then um, during when your stress level is sky high and like you, you just want to give up, quit. Um, physically, it can harm you physically and mentally. But like sometimes you just need a long break to get away from it. Just like go out, be with family, friends, movies, girls' night, whatever. It it takes a lot of stress off you. And in a study, it says a number of agencies now allow employees and a certain numbers of pay. Uh, it lets them have days off for like if they're mentally unstable or if they're upset and they don't know what to do. They just need like a break from whatever it is they're stressed with. And that's all I have. And, and so for the homework, we have on Wednesday, we'll be talking about time management and some time saver tips. So we're going to do a um, time monitor sheet. And with this, you just kind of plan out your week with the time, you know, plan out your schedule. And then we're going come to come to class and just talk about it notice any areas that you can improve on or uh, how to make a pri uh, priority list. And also, I forgot to explain the handout at the beginning, so I'll do it right now. Um, in the middle, we have, we attach the evaluation form so that you guys can take notes as we're presenting. It's a little late for the first day. I apologize, but um, that's just to give you guys more time and to actually give us feedback. So, um, we have a little bit of time right now, you guys can do that if you feel like it. But that's all we have today. So thank you.